Uh, it was a bike that, as a kid, and our family run a BSA BMW dealership that I always admired, but as a kid, couldn't afford to have myself. And uh, as time passed and uh, we got away from that, uh, uh, the Rocket Gold Star, of course, is a rare bike. And I thought, wouldn't it be wonderful to track one of these down and, and restore it to what it was back when I was a kid? And that was back in, of course, 1963. So. Uh, I found out through word of mouth there was one in a barn in uh, Pennsylvania and I called and got the name and inquired, drove an old 77 New York Park Avenue, you know, pulling a trailer and uh, bought it from the son of the fellow who passed away and it became mine. It was in uh, very poor condition. It was a uh, bike that was a chopper basically that uh, was revamped. And what really was attractive to me was the, the flamboyant red, you know, the metallic, the, the color was just uh, right for this type of machine. And unlike so many new machines, the old BSAs are what motorcycles were really meant to look like. These are machines that have a lot of chrome, a lot of flash. Uh, it's fun, my dad used to say, if you want to have fun, get on a BSA. But if you want to get there, get on a BMW, you know. So to me, I've had the best of both worlds because I, I enjoy both, uh, both machines. But this is my passion, really, is the BSA. Actually, I don't think any of it was really very hard. It was amazingly simple. Um, the thing that worried me was the time that I would dedicate to this that would take away from uh, uh, things that, uh, to, to share time with my wife. Uh, she's most understanding and she's given me the freedom to do this and it's been terrific. I've been coming here for year after year for many years. It's not about the machine, it's about the people, really. It's great. And the AMA, I, you know, I've been a life member on the AMA and it's, uh, you know, bike racing, the whole thing, it's, it's good. I'm glad to see that the AMA is still, you know, strong and doing what they're doing. I've always loved bikes, I'm just extending my childhood.